How's it going you guys? This is Sasquatch Hunter here. Well, this video is basically me in a failed Bigfoot hunting attempt and who cares if I go hunting for Bigfoot or not? It was just, yeah, as a matter of fact, I wasn't even hunting for Bigfoot. I was just going through a midnight walk through the woods and just seeing what I could see, even though it wasn't technically midnight. It was probably around 8 or 9 o'clock at night, so I wasn't technically a Bigfoot hunting. It would be interesting if something happened, but literally the camera was like dying out, so the footage is going to be pretty choppy, but... It's still, it's still pretty creepy, that woods, so I hope you guys enjoy what there is, and I'll be sure to keep you updated what's going on with the channel, and there'll be more videos coming soon, and just enjoy the video. How's it going, you guys? The Sasquatch Hunter here. I'm here in beautiful... Here's a million dollar view right there. Check it out. So, I want to get a nice, interesting vlog going, and, you know, I think it's time for this channel to live up to its name. For all you haters who think that I'm that crazy kid, a retarded kid who thinks Sasquatch is real. Well, I'm not. Take out crazy and retarded, but Sasquatch is honestly real. No doubt about it. And I'm not going to like go and make weird noises and hunt. I'm just going to go for a walk and I'm going to go see what's going on. And all you haters, who cares what you say? You're just trying to give me a reason to make my channel go down. And it's just like all the, all the hate you give somebody, I'm uh, that... That will just come back to you in other in other forms, cause those who say ba or do bad things about other people get it in return. That's a saying I once heard. But enough of the haters. Haters suck, and there's a diss track coming on the haters. So yeah, and you know, for people who think like, hey Joe, there's Sasquatch right there. I know that's just a joke, people. I'm not that dumb. Come on, people. So you, those of you watching, if you were the ones who said that, you know I'm smarter than that, and. I just wanted to stop. <laughs> okay, well, let's get, let's just quit drilling in the haters. I'll get more of the hater distract later. So, I wanted to go over like, so of course this is the North Woods, Minnesota, and beautiful place, but this forest I'm in, <laughs> cabin is, you know what? It's called the Quiet Forest, and it's called that for a reason. And last year I was up and, well actually the story starts two years ago, I never really put much up about this place when I was young, but as I got older, I knew stuff, something was offset here. There was one time I was like down here, like work at the lake, like working in wood, and then I heard like a growling sound right next to me. I mean, I could feel a presence, but turn around, there's nothing there. I'm not, I'm not joking. I'm, I honestly heard the stuff. And just last year, there was one night where I was like really scared and like, I couldn't hear anything, maybe like a wolf howl or something, or a loon, but, you know, it's just like, you can't hear nothing, and when you hear nothing, like, there's no squirrels, no crickets, no birds chirping at night, it's just absolutely quiet, there wasn't even wind that night, and it was just, really got my attention, and I wanted to know what was going on, so that night was when I really thought something was going on, in the summer before that, when I heard the growling sounds, and it was like everywhere, like, I got, why not back up to the cabin, locked myself in, had a window in open, it sounds literally right by the window and there's nothing there. So, I think it's a little more than a Bigfoot, but I'm hoping to find out what it is. I know there's pro there's been Bigfoot sightings in this area before, and what what perfect place, it's quiet, and there's like nothing here. So, and they called the quiet force for a reason, I want to find out what that reason is. So, you guys, we're going to go on this journey. I don't know, this might be one of my longest videos yet, so let's make it a good one. I'm finally on the woods and we're about to go do some Bigfoot hunting in the quiet forest. And for all you haters out there, we don't believe in Bigfoot saying I'm crazy on my mind. This is just how the channel is up to its name and I'm when I say it talk about Bigfoot, I'm not joking around, like I actually think there's something real. I think there's something else here in the quiet forest in northern Minnesota. And I think there's a reason they call it the quiet forest. Well besides it's all quiet, there has to be something here keeping it quiet. And I think it's time to go do a little investigating, so let's go check some stuff out. And sorry if you can't see my face, cause the lighting, my flashlight, I'm using ain't too good, but hopefully we can get a good look at the forest and see what's going on. I don't know if you can hear right now, except for the background music that might be coming from the cabin, is just a little music, but we're gonna go look for Bigfoot and we'll see if there's any, get any noise or signs. So let's get a looking. All right, so can't really see much but 
It is really quiet. I'm right on the driveway coming in and looking in the woods. I think I'm gonna walk again to the woods and like circle back towards the cabin. Just for, like find an animal trail or something. Used by something big. Here it drops off a little down into the woods. Wish I had a better light, but yeah, it doesn't look like there's been too much action here, but because we all can hear, it's quiet. Fallen trees. Bigfoot's been known to push down trees, but I think that's just from the wind. Okay. Another one. And cuts. I don't know. We got. Okay, now this might actually be something here. So, Bigfoot's are known to like move trees in areas where like there they are, like kind of crossing each other. And it looks like this one's been moved because as you can see, the roots right here, there, you can't even. I know it's might have been a long time since this tree fell down, but can't even tell where on the ground it was. And then it's like kind of around this other tree, so this could be a territory marker. That's why they cross trees together. I'm gonna push in further and see what else there is. Rain, so it's a little wet. I don't know. I hope there's something in here. I mean, like, I honestly get scared easily, but I just want to see some signs. I mean, I know that tree right there came down with the wind, just like the way it's still in the ground and stuff. A few years ago, we were up here right after we cooked up some steaks, and then there was a brush pile, and one of the most foul odors you'll ever smell was coming from it. Dogs were freaking out like they've never freaked out before, and the brush pile was bouncing up and down. It could have been a bear, that's what everybody else thought, but I think it was something else. I, I thought it was a bear at the time too until I heard, did more research and found the Bigfoot sleeve of hollow stench. Yeah, it's not too much here. Lighting is trash right now, but yeah. I'm gonna go, go back and get a better light, cutting the vlog for now. All right, so. I'm gonna go back into these woods right here where I saw the trees crossed and I'm gonna go see what I can find. I don't wanna stay out for too long because normally when I'm up here in northern Minnesota, nighttime, that's my signal to get inside because after that, I'm out. I'm done. Nothing else going on outside after that. Because there's something out here in these woods. It's just not natural and it's just here stalking us, I just know it. Yeah, but nighttime, I'm out of here. I'm like bolting. Except for tonight, because tonight is an occasion. This is my first actual time going Bigfoot hunting on camp. Currently, the camera batteries are going on and off, so I have to finish the, up this hunt quickly. But I don't think nothing, not much is going to happen tonight, because all that I heard was the dogs barking, and yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. But every night, during the day, you can hear birds and squirrels everywhere, but at nighttime, it's absolute quiet. And right here, here's a hilltop. This, right here, we got a hilltop, which is a perfect vantage point for some stocking, like over there, like where we, we all hang out. Well, I'm gonna get out of here because, like I said, nighttime I'm out, and but tonight was our occasion. I'll pick up the vlog when I get back. I'll pick up the vlog when I get back home, and I'll see you guys next time. Now, I'd have to say that was probably a big oof. I didn't really see anything, but it was creepy as heck, and definitely gonna go do some more investigating next time I'm up there, but sorry about the long wait for videos. There's gonna be more videos coming this summer. I'm not gonna have a regular schedule, but maybe on our, maybe two or three videos a week at the most, and maybe five for a week or so, I don't know. It's just hard to do daily vlogs and all that, but I don't wanna be, get boring either. I want to be one of the boring YouTubers, so... Hey guys, and also give me some video ideas for my vlogs, like, I plan on doing another chugging video, chugging to the extreme, chugging through a garden hose, like, put, like, turn the garden hose and then try to put, aim it right at my mouth so I can get tons of water in, so that'll be something interesting. 
But yeah, guys, if you don't like this video, I totally understand. I just need to get something out there, and this was requested by one of my biggest fans, and yeah. And lately, the video, this is a good example, like the trucking compilation, like, I, I actually kind of want to do that, but this point, this video here, the reason I'm doing it is because it's not, it's not for me, it's for somebody who wanted it, so it's just hard doing it that way, because I want to get back to posting, like, I like making stuff that everybody likes, but I want to do stuff that, like, I actually want to post. Like, this video I actually don't want to post, but I'm just doing it to get some content out there, because... I'm get this. I know this is a few people want to see. So, guys, if you don't like it, just give please give me positive feedback, and the best is yet to come. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Subscribe for more content. Turn on post notifications and drop some likes in this video. Let's try to get 10 likes in this video. All right, see you guys.